Right, that's me entering VRCraft world. To build your world you can choose from 500,000 models, completely free, available at Sketchfab. Just search, click on something, it pops right in. Drop it wherever you want. When building your world, you may want to start with terrain. Terrains come in all shapes and sizes. They are like from 1 megabyte to 100 megabyte. Big, so choose carefully. There it is. Now just walk around and drop it anywhere. Now once you drop it you see how small it is. So first thing you want to do is increase the size of the terrain. Click on the button resize to resize it and then just drag. More you drag, more you resize it. Drag up to increase the size or drag down to decrease the size. Oh, who's there? That's an accidental bystander, really? Hey, you! Well, that's really just another me. See, it's all in multi-user. While you're bu building a world, other people can see what you're doing. Like, like this. Right away. And they can also add their own stuff in here. She's like, oh, I want to build a house here. Click. And she carries it around. Then she drops it somewhere. So a line drops anything on top of whatever is below it. You can rotate it around if you mess up, don't worry. Just click on upright if you mess up anything. I want to add some trees. Let's see how many trees we have there. Ooh, that's many trees. Well, this one. And you know, just carry it around, drop it somewhere you want it. If this gets in the way, just put it aside. Click on search and, and turn around. Again, I want a bigger tree. This one is too small. Well, not bad. I want more trees. Click. Click, move. Copy, move. Copy, move. Copy, move. All the other trees are just clones. Just clones of the of the original tree. And 
and that's it. Like, how do you like it, Bruce? Collaboration in virtual worlds on the web. I don't know. Let me see in in VR, maybe. <laughs> 